Join Chris and Kale for breakfast, lunch, and dinner in Savannah, Georgia. The Artesia is sea crab soup. Open your mind, and this is a delicacy. That is a chicken pot pie. That does look amazing. Oh, you oh, the no. oh, it's party pal. Oh man, those are looking really good. That looks incredible. That smells awesome. That's a big effort on my <laughs> Happy birthday. Savannah, Georgia is a charming southern town highlighted by period architecture, a rich history, and exquisite eateries, all in an area lined with live oaks draped in elegant Spanish moths. It is here in the nation's most haunted city that local restaurants serve up exemplary southern dishes highlighted by ingredients straight from the coast. It is a food lover's paradise. But before we dig into some of the best spots for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, let us introduce you to some of Savannah's best attractions. Collins Quarter is a bustling and vibrant cafe with an all-day brunch menu that transforms into an elegant candlelit dinner service at night. We just grabbed some specialty coffees, but learned that their two locations have absolutely picturesque settings with a culinary reputation that will satisfy your inner foodie. is an epic name under which culinary legend Sean Brock transformed the essence of Southern food at the original Charleston location. Now Huss serves up elevated Southern fare and cocktails in a landmark mansion within Savannah's historic district. The restaurant was greeted with high expectations and has been exceeding them ever since opening in 2018. We had brunch here at one of Savannah's top dining experiences. It's a North Carolina town. Yeah, Where yeah. in the world do you get North Carolina? Is it off the coast? It's, a, it's an ocean thing. It's, it's, an not, ocean. it's, not, a, yeah. it's not a fresh water. Yeah. I'm really excited about it because I think 
figure a place like us. Good fried chicken. I don't know. Something that adds some color. Radish? That would be easy. See how juicy that is on the inside? It's so crispy on the outside. Well, that's awesome. We have the hot sauce. Their own hot sauce. Well, you did a good job. The Pirate's House has been welcoming visitors to Savannah since 1753, serving up a bounty of delicious food and drink just a scant jaunt from the Savannah River. This is indeed one of the most historic and haunted spots in Georgia, a place where tales of hidden tunnels and being Shanghai abound. Come enjoy an extensive menu and thirst-quenching drinks within the same walls where pirates and sailors did the same hundreds of years ago. Oh, definitely corn muffins. So this is a crab melt. We got some fries, and this is their their gumbo. She crab soup. A little chicken salad croissant, and uh, here's a house salad. My gumbo is excellent, but that's even better. <laughs> so good. It's so creamy. Yeah. Trailer Park is where owner Trey Wilder takes familiar classics and bar foods to create what has been dubbed elevated white trash dishes. The uniqueness of the menu is only surpassed by the quality of ingredients and spot on execution. The restaurant has been featured on television and social media, all while becoming a hit with locals and visitors alike. Open your mind and come enjoy life within the trailer park. So what do they look like? That's what they look like. Some banana hot pepper. Fragaloni. Oh, you gotta get under the egg. Oh, I see it. Oh, it's thin. I think it's like what you expect. But to be honest with you, that's pretty good. You gotta just open your mind. And this is a delicacy. That is a chicken pot pie. That's crazy. It is a, a deep fried burrito. It's like a chimichanga. with a chicken pot pie flavor in the middle. I'm taking it back. I love it though. It's really good. It was sweet tea bourbon, that's right. A shot of sweet tea bourbon. That's a little strange. But you know what? It was on the menu and it sounds intriguing. Oh wow. That's crazy good. That's not bourbon. Vix on the River is a fine dining restaurant located within an old cotton warehouse that was a strategic location for General Sherman's army during the Civil War. Well, we gotta take the elevator. Now, they use the historic building to serve up splendid southern cuisine that has achieved more awards and media attention than you can shake a stick at. With live music, an ample bar, and the drop of the elegant Savannah River, this is a place where date night meets friendly hangout. Is that? I'm all about it. Oh, wow. <laughs> that does look amazing. 
I'm gonna have to put this on top, but I'm glad they did because now you get to see. What is this right here? Is that the cheese? Oh my gosh. What's this? Some sort of roulade or something? Oh my gosh, and like grits. I'm excited, I got a sample list. Yeah. Oh, you dropped a oh, no. pickle. Oh, it's party foul. Alright, you ready? Uh huh. It's a big one. Oh my god. <laughs> the chicken is so tender and juicy. He just took my clean plate. But you can vouch, I, I did eat it all, right? Did you? Yes, I did. Sorry Charlie's is Savannah's premier oyster bar, serving beers and cocktails alongside fresh local seafood with an emphasis on southern regional flavors. Housed in one of the oldest commercial buildings in Georgia, they even have a rooftop where you can enjoy the sunset with a glass of your favorite beverage. Wait, you can kind of tell. I think these go together, these go together, these go together. So you just want to get one of each. Boone River Brewing is housed in one of the oldest, most historic, and haunted buildings in Savannah. Open as a hotel in 1821, it served as a warehouse until the 1960s before being renovated into the brew pub concept. Today, you can enjoy beers, cocktails, and elevated bar food at this frequent stop for haunted tour groups. Private event closed. Oh! Oh, can we go up there? We can't go up there? Yeah, we can't go up there. You have to be part of a tour group. No trespassing. You have to go step over the honors point. Really? Yeah. The Old Pink House serves a classic Southern cuisine within an elegant mansion built in 1771. It has been one of Savannah's most sought after restaurants, gaining a spot as one of the nation's top five most romantic dining experiences. This is according to Open Table. The inventive Southern cuisine is only part of the experience as the architecture, decor, and rich history create an ambiance, one that extends downstairs to the haunted cellar tavern.
Alligator Soul is one of Savannah's premier restaurants, bringing an unpretentious fine dining experience to eclectic Southern cuisine within a former basement grain warehouse. Their extensive menu is highlighted by organic, fresh, natural, day boat, local, and regional fare. The experience starts with fresh creative cocktails and extends through to delectable house-made desserts. Rodney Strong. I don't know anything about wine. Like, I only know what I like. And I do like it. What kind of, what kind of notes does it have? <laughs> like a C note? <laughs> Give me the starter here. Oh, yo, oh, yeah. Alligator Dan Critters. That looks incredible. It's very good. There's some oils and stuff in there that are really making it very succulent, very, very tasty. Think about how succulent it is. Like flavors fill my mouth. That's all I'm worried about. Look at that. It's coming off so tender. Look at that. Look at that. Indulgent meal. Oh. Oh yes. I almost had a clean pretty plate. Pretty good. That's yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. Where's your meat? It's gone. It's my <laughs> here. They're happy to get that. That's pretty that's realistic. The, is that the best presentation? Yeah. Wow. That's the peanut butter pie. People have been lining up for Leopold's ice cream in historic Savannah since 1919, often in lines that extend down the block. From award-winning homemade super premium ice cream to fresh squeezed fruit drinks, coffees, and fresh baked treats, a visit to Leopold's will help you understand how 100-year-old recipes can lead to a place among the best ice cream shops in the world. We're going in. Lemon custard. And I think I'm gonna go with the rum bisque. Thanks for joining Chris and Kale for breakfast, lunch, and dinner in Savannah, Georgia. Thanks for watching. We hope this gets you excited about getting out and exploring on your own. Click to the right to subscribe. Click to the left for more adventures.